Hey everybody. Today I'm going to lead you through the steps to playback recordings stored on your device's hard drive. Before we get started, make sure your device is connected to a monitor and running the latest software version. Be aware that our tech support agents cannot assist you over the phone if you are not running the latest software version. If you keep your device connected to the internet, the software updates are automatic. Now, for those of you who do not keep their device connected to the internet, you have two options for updating the software. The easiest way to update the software is to connect your device to the internet and go through the startup wizard. The software will be automatically updated, and when you're finished, you can disconnect from the internet if you choose. The following steps show you how to update the software the easy way. If your device is powered on and not connected to the internet, turn the device off. Connect one end of the included Ethernet cable to the back of the device and the other end to an open port on your router, and now turn the device back on. If your device is already connected to the internet, there's no need to turn it off. Once the device is powered back on, right-click the mouse anywhere on the screen to open up the menu bar. Left-click on the Startup Wizard icon and then log into your account. As you go through the startup wizard, the device will check for and install the latest software version. Now, if you refuse to take the easy route, the second way is to manually download the software from your device's series page on the Night Owl support site. Go to support.nightowlsp.com and enter your device's series info into the search bar. You can locate this info on the device's support sticker. Now that you're running the latest software, we can get started. Make sure the date on the DVR matches the current date. If the date, time, or time zone is incorrect, your recordings have been stored based on those settings. When you do update this to the correct date and time, your existing recordings do not update. So when you're looking for a recording, remember it is based on that wrong info. But the future recordings will be stored according to the accurate date and time. All right, let's get to the playback screen. Right-click the mouse to bring up the menu bar. Left-click the playback icon. If you aren't logged in, you'll be prompted to do so and then taken to the playback screen. If you're already logged in, the playback screen will appear. If the message no channel to select or no matched record file appears on screen, click OK to continue. We are now on the playback screen. With that in mind, select the date of the recording you want to watch. Select the camera or cameras that you want to play back and click on the play icon. When the recording is playing, you can use the toolbar to rewind, fast forward, and pause. For more information on your product, go to support.nightowlsp.com. Enter your device's series into the search bar to access support materials, including videos and troubleshooting articles. The series is listed on the device's support sticker, along with the component model number and the UID number. Our support site should always be your first choice when you need help with or have questions about your device. Thank you for watching and being a Night Owl customer.